Hey everyone, Thornton here, and Helldivers 2 has been going through a lot of changes, like the Automaton Foe coming back with more strength than ever, and with that, we're going to need new weaponry, and well, don't worry, Arrowhead has us covered, and today we're going to go over the latest leaks and images of the upcoming weaponry, not only for us, but for the upcoming Illuminate Faction 2, because we have a little bit of information about that. But without further ado, let's jump into today's video. Helldivers 2 is gearing up for a massive offensive against the Automaton Menace as they have returned in tenfold after we eradicated them in Swift Disassembly and we are going to be getting some assistance with the new Democratic War Bond releasing today. However, soon after we are getting a new arsenal of devastating weaponry that is going to change the game. But these aren't your standard issue sidearms, comrades. These are game changers and coupled with the intel of incoming enemy advancements, I'm looking at you, the Illuminate, we're looking at a whole new kind of battlefield. So let's delve into this intel and see how these weapons can secure humanity's future and maybe rain some serious hell down in the process. The big one that I want to talk about first is the R36 Eruptor. And this bad boy is a grenade launcher on steroids. Now, with some of the community feedback on Reddit, it suggests that this is an exceptional area of denial ability weapon. Imagine flushing out entrenched bugs or vaporizing entire hordes with a single well-placed shot. And the R36 Eruptor could become an essential tool for both offensive push and defensive choke point control. Along with that, with the recent addition of flyers and airships, there is the Air Burst Rocket Launcher, and this one promises a new level of tactical flexibility. There's some early tests indicating the ability to detonate the rockets mid-air, which is just crazy and a very cool design. This opens doors for taking down those pesky flyers and raining down hell on enemies behind cover. But beware, because, well, this game has friendly fire and it might be a bit bigger of a concern than we originally anticipated. But then we've got to also go ahead and pack a punch at close quarters, and that's where the new heavy pistol will come in. The details are scarce, but this was recently data mined and put on Reddit, and it hints at a sidearm with serious stopping power. The thing looks like a deagle. This could be a game changer for close quarters combat, especially when dealing with those pesky single enemy spawns that disrupt formations. But it's not just about the sidearms and what you're packing on your hip. It does look like in the near future, we're going to be getting atomic nuclear bombs because the rumors seem to be true. We're getting nukes. And while the community seems divided on its tactical use, the potential for base clearing and total annihilation is undeniable. Just remember, coordination is key. I've seen way too many people already killed by the 500 kilogram bombs from an eagle. I can only imagine what will come with a nuke. However, with all these additions, the enemy is going to be evolving too, as we did get an image of the Illuminate Outcast Beamer, and they seem to have force field. The combination of offensive and defensive capabilities poses a serious threat. But we also talked about some things that could help us overtake this, such as that R36 Eruptor's area denial could potentially bypass the force field flushing out the enemy. The air burst rocket could rain down behind the shield, taking down the outcast before they can react, and a well-placed heavy pistol shot might overload the force field. Maybe I'm just being a little too hopeful there, but it could create a window for a decisive blow. All that being said, the incoming weapons promise to shake up the established meta in Helldivers 2. Mastering these new tools and using them strategically against the evolving enemy is going to be absolutely paramount as we continue to take over the galaxy and spread democracy. And while the community grapples with the tactical implications, like the potential for friendly fire with the air burst launcher. I know one of you guys are going to do it. It's probably going to be my friend Beast Mode Bear. That's right, I'm calling you out. One thing is for certain, Helldivers 2 is about to get a whole lot more explosive, literally and figuratively. So grab your trusty stratagems, comrades, and prepare to take down the automatons and the upcoming Illuminate. Oh yeah, I guess there's bugs too, but you know, they kind of suck now. Let me know down below, what are you most looking forward to coming into Helldivers 2, especially when it comes to weaponry, and are you looking forward to going toe-to-toe -to -toe with the Illuminate faction in the near future? Also, don't forget to check out these videos right here where I cover news and information on other video games, and until next time, everyone, thanks for stopping by. I'll see you in the next video.